Hello, it's Friday. Thank God it's Friday. It's sometimes I just feel like the Maytag man, just sitting around my desk waiting for something to happen. Today was no exception, just a slow, slow, slow day. Um, it's probably just the way it's going to be because I mean, our numbers are good, everything's there. The money's, the money's out there, it's just trickling though. Um, anyways, it's Friday. I don't have to worry about that anymore. Um, I am thinking about doing a little adventure with these dudes this weekend. Do a little test run in the car. Um, one, just to get us all out of the house. Two, just to make sure that they get used to being in the car. Because if I need to travel, I want them to be able to travel with me. That was one of the ideas. A dog said not with a cat. Um, cats can be taught to travel too, but you have to get them young. Otherwise, otherwise it's just harder. Um, anyways, we're gonna we're gonna walk. It's warm today. It's it's pushing a hundred. I think I don't think it's quite there, but it's it's warm and it's not all that breezy. So that's not helping. It's just a little bit stagnant out here. So. We're going to walk, and I'll be back with you in a bit. Hey, I'm over here trying to figure out that squeaking and thumping noise. And so I pulled this up. I couldn't see anything under there that looked like it was loose, but... Hear that reverberation in there? It's, it's in there somewhere, so I'm going to have to pull that door panel off. Uh, Cause it's gonna drive me crazy until I get it fixed. I I can't get it to do anything else anywhere else. There's a little piece of trim, this little right down here by the passenger's feet. That guy was loose. It's not making the noise. It's just it's just loose, and I've gotten it best I could. Um, the seat's not squeaking so it's not the seat but it is a really annoying noise so anyways i gotta get i gotta sort through that also huh, interesting it's just things you find after after the fact um the seat's rubbing really tight right here um, up against that uh, center console. A little bit tighter than the passenger side. I wonder if that can be adjusted. But the seat doesn't squeak. Nothing. And I can't make it squeak. But I am hearing that little bit of reverberation in the door panel there when I knock on it. So, anyways, this is enough of that. Um, these guys are getting hungry. This is getting close to there meal time and I gotta run into town to get some things tonight. So I'm gonna get them fed now. I'm gonna get on the road and then go do very uninteresting things. Um, nothing interesting, nothing interesting is gonna happen. But anyways, now that I love you guys, I'm thinking about you. Hope you guys are doing well and feeling healthy. Hope your weather is, I, it's supposed to be hot over there on the West Coast, I know that, in the Pacific Northwest, so. I hope you guys stay warm, stay cool, stay hydrated. It is Seafair weekend, so maybe there's something for you guys to do. Uh, at least the Seattle folks. I don't imagine the Oregon folks are going to drive up there um, just to watch those festivities. But uh, anyways, in the meantime, I love you guys. I really do. I'm thinking about you. hope you guys are having a good day. And uh, I will see you tomorrow. Sorry, this wasn't a very interesting one. I don't have much to talk about. My brain is just, it's so slow at work. It, the, the brain just, it, it's a whole different kind of brain fog. It, nothing that works. But uh, anyways, one of these days I will come up with something exciting to talk to you guys about. But until then, you know that I'm just, I'm just eking my way out through life. I'm just trying to figure out how to just figuring out how life works. 45-year-old man trying to figure out how life works. I think 
everybody would say they're doing the same. So I love you guys. I'll see you later.